Hello everyone. I'm very excited for today's video because I'm about to go shopping because I'm going to decorate my patio. It's really bright, you can barely see it, but here's some better footage. So it's obviously very empty right now and I know kind of what I want but I've just kind of not been pulling the trigger because like you can't I don't want to order patio furniture online because then you can't test it out but then I haven't wanted to get it in person because then you need a car to be able to put it in and as you guys have seen my car is a fucking disaster. So um, Lisa's gonna drive because she's just my handy van slash uber slash um, she's the best. She's coming to pick me up in like five minutes and we're gonna go to Target and then she suggested maybe Pier 1 and uh, Home Depot which while we're at Home Depot, I think we'll also pick out some paint for my office, which Lisa's going to do as well because I can't. Okay, let's go. In the big car. Did you just get stuck? Yep. Forward a little. We're good. Where should we go first? She stole her roommate's car so we could fit things. <laughs> her roommate works for the Backstreet Boys. That's amazing. Where is there a Pier 1? I don't know. I just made Home that up. Is there a Pier 1? I'd say let's skip. Pier One and go to Home Depot Home and Target. Depot has stuff, right? I think so, but regardless, we have to pick out paint for my oh, office. That's so take ten hours. Okay. I don't think it'll take that. I'm pretty decisive. Starting route to the Home Depot. To the Home Depot. I need you guys to see how little Lisa is in this car. <laughs> yeah. The selection's not great. Yeah. yeah. I don't know if there's anything outside. Well, should we get the paint now? Get the paint. Yeah. Also blue gray. Oh my god. See, that's what I was, I'm kind of leaning towards. And then they sit here and they like give you some options of like how they put together some of them. <sighs> See, I like like even like really dark, but then. But like maybe you don't just do one wall dark. Maybe I'm definitely staying enough. in this section. You could not I got something like overwhelming. This. I want to do one of them blue, but I just got that shelf thing and I feel like that's blue, so it would be weird. Not if you don't, maybe you put that against the gray wall and the other one's yeah, the blue but wall. Yeah, it doesn't fit. Maybe I do that far wall blue then. But then that's also that blue is it's like a dark blue like that or whatever. It really, it would... hey, who's gonna be able to tell? Me. <laughs> you know I'd be there. You can always just take these swatches home, hold them up, Photoshop it off, come back. We can hit this thing, and you can scan your color. Visualize now. This is what it looks like. Um, you're right. This is a lot. That's why I took a bunch home, and then I decided. I don't know. I feel like they're all the same. They'll mix you a sample that's like a little thing for a couple bucks and you put it home and you just... That's too 200 years later. <laughs> I don't really have much to say because there's not a whole lot going on in here. <laughs> Lisa was just reminding me that she used to work at the Home Depot. I did. I worked at one in like Washington DC. You couldn't bring your vest. You can't um, bring your apron home. You have to leave it at the store every day. You have to lock it in your locker. Because they don't want you they don't impersonating. They don't want people because someone like Lily would do that for a video. What else? No. <laughs> no, I'm kind of over it. Let's go to Target. All right. Big Target or Little Target? Big Target, obviously. Lisa still uses Foursquare. It's now called Swarm. Thank you very much. It's owned by the same people. They also What's have Foursquare. What's the point? Still. I would get, I'll get to be the mayor. Leave me alone. <laughs> we got to Target, so. Back right. We can't pass my candles. We can't pass my candles. She'll buy another 30 of them. I already burned through one. <laughs> I highly recommend the ones with the um, wicker. wooden wick because it sounds like a fireplace. Lisa has brought us really off course. Um, this is my favorite as seen on TV aisle. <laughs> I didn't know they had that seen yeah, on TV aisle. Well, guys, look at you. They can make pigs off. in a blanket. They're in the shape of pigs. pigs. Because why not? I mean, there's no reason not. Speaking of cooking, I'm here from the future to tell you that today's episode is sponsored by HelloFresh. HelloFresh is a meal kit service. They send you all the ingredients you need and the recipe. So they make it super, super easy so someone like me can even do it. Each week they have 20 plus seasonal recipes that are all chef curated. So there's something for everyone. And if you have kind of a weird schedule, you could always change days or change how many meals you're gonna get. It's super flexible. Look, I made this meal that you're seeing right now. Look, at this is me making it in like less than 30 minutes. And this time I made alone, by the way. I want to clarify. I made their Parmesan crusted chicken with creamy lemon tomato spaghetti. I cannot believe how easy it was slash how well I did. It looked super gourmet. Like if I made that for someone, no one would believe that I did it. HelloFresh is now available from $5.56 per serving. Just like last time, you can get started with eight free meals, which is $80 off your first order. If you go to hellofresh.com, enter the code LilyMarston80. Between cooking and furnishing my balcony, which we should get back to actually, because that's why you're watching this video. Let's go. 
Finally made it. Oh yeah, we have been here before so because I sat in that chair. Just in this nice bird cage of yours. Lily's moving into Target. I love this chair so much, you guys. It's so nice and comfy. Oh, I, need, I need something more like a... This is what I looked at online. Oh, this one? Is, is that comfortable? Ooh. It looks like the other one you were sitting in at Home Depot. It actually is better than the Home Depot one, but... And if you got a couple more pillows. That probably looks comfier, but it's not very cute. Uh, I want a hanging one, but I feel like that is difficult to install. Yeah. I have a flat butt, so it doesn't really matter to me. Everything just feels like... But how many of these would you get? Two? To start with, I think like, so. You get the bench, Let's put a cushion on it. Why is there only one? Yeah. You have to call for somebody. Or they might just make you just put this in the chair. <laughs> oh, or they just like actually only have one. They might just have one. You might just have to ask if they have two. Well, apparently it's the last one they have. Should I get the one and then order another one? <laughs> She's very helpful. I just order them both on the internet so then we don't have to carry it. I found your chairs. This is what she's pointing to. I think this is turning into a uh, going home and ordering everything online because they don't have it here. So yeah, a lot of hours spent in Target and um, all of it just ended up being kind of a waste of time. At least I was seeing what was out there and I got to test out some chairs. But um, you're going to be kind of surprised when you see what I went with. Best way to do this is take it out and put it facing the right direction. And so forth. Okay, so now it's just how do I get that out there? Okay. Oh, there. That's stage one. I have some plants. That carpet is definitely too small. I ordered the wrong one. We'll make more progress tomorrow. My task rabbit has arrived. Oh, I have a lot of plants so far. <laughs> Lisa's <laughs> drunk off Dr. Pepper. <laughs> Filmed our Dr. Pepper video. Go watch it. It's live now. Oh, I'm not very smart. You already turned that over that, so it's so <laughs> Yep. Alright, is your screw bottom? Yep. I'm so excited to sit on this. The wild Lisa puts together yet another one of my pieces of furniture. Um, P.S. I think I mentioned that I bought the wrong size of rug, so then I bought the right size today. I'm not really sure what to do with that one. She said it's done. It's ready for lounging. Oh, it's just like I remembered. <laughs> what would be also really fun? Turn this into just... <laughs> A napping cocoon. And just You're just gonna it. string lights through all of it oh, and like nice put a too. sheet just in case you want some privacy. I was thinking that. Like just make it like a dark like so then my legs just hang out. Like what Yzma has in Emperor's New Group on Kron's shoulders. Cusco must be eliminated. The Empire will finally be rid of that She's like an old hunter. Don't act like you don't know what I'm talking about. I don't. About. I never really watched that one. Oh, it's a great one. I'm just gonna go on this side. I don't know, I was gonna get two smaller chairs for over here. Isn't it comfy? I'm happy with it. It's a little large in comparison, but you know. Should I just get another one? Or should I just get... I think you should maybe... I feel like you probably want more than one person or two people to sit out here, so maybe that way you can... Get a couple. Yeah. Maybe some like cushions for the so ground. There would be room even if someone brought a folding chair out here to sit with the other chairs. There'd be space. You're acting you can like fit. I have a lot of parties and stuff. It won't. You can fit two people right here. That's true. No, don't sit next to me though. Ew. I thought it was an invitation. Gross. I'll see you guys again in the future when I decide whether I should get another one of these or finally two finish this patio. That.
waited to cheers. Sorry, sorry. Cheers. Cheers. It is really nice.